The venomous snakes, known as king cobras, are extremely hazardous. Because of their strong venom, they can kill up to 11 people in a single bite. Some animals, on the other hand, have the agility, brains, and power to confront venomous snakes. Morphology, attacking methods, and size are the most significant distinctions between a king cobra and a mongoose. The king cobra is a limbless reptile that may grow up to 19 feet long and kills prey with venomous fangs. Mongooses are carnivorous creatures that grow to be only 2.5 feet long and destroy their prey with ferocious jaws. These monsters are extremely dissimilar, and their differences will have a huge impact on the conflict. Mongooses kill their prey with their deadly bites. They have 28 teeth, four of which are long incisors capable of easily cracking bones. Mongooses, too, have keen senses. They have excellent hearing, sight, and smell, allowing them to see prey beneath the ground. The king cobra only attacks by rearing up and biting with venomous bites. The venom is so potent that a single bite can kill 11 people. These snakes have fangs that can sink deep into their prey and inject up to 1,000 ng of venom. The king cobra is an ambush predator that hides in its surroundings before leaping out and biting its prey. It's only a matter of time before their prey succumbs to their bite. Mongooses are pursuit hunters and can hunt in groups or alone. They locate prey that is suitable for them, then pursue and kill the animal. To put down the mongoose, the king cobra will most likely bite it multiple times. Meanwhile, the animal is more faster and more agile, and with just one bite, it can crush a snake's skull. As a result, the mongoose begins the combat by running about the king cobra, gauging its reactions and hunting for an opportunity. Because the king cobra rises to battle, it will have to swivel its head to follow the mongoose at some point. If you like this video, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and activate the notification bell. The mongoose will notice its opening after a few strikes, biting the cobra and killing it. Despite its size, the king cobra's head is vulnerable to the mongoose. The fight becomes more difficult as the snake grows longer. To inflict a deadly bite, the mongoose would have to wait for a strike and then counter or climb the king cobra. It appears that the mammal that is continually hunting dangerous snakes will emerge victorious. However, it's likely that the mongoose system is overwhelmed by the king cobra's huge deadly bite. The mongoose would be vulnerable on the ground in that circumstance and would be eaten.